Hi, I'm here with Freddie Lozano of AECOM. Freddie, thanks for being here. Thanks for having me. Can you tell us a little bit about what you consider to be the best practices for CAD standards management? Sure. One of the biggest uh, practices that I would recommend uh, a lot of CAD users or CAD managers, actually, um, being from a huge company that's uh, on a daily basis, you know, uh, obtaining other companies and trying to integrate uh, standards. Mm -hmm. uh, standards is a big one with us because we need to try to make everybody uh, use the same type of formatting so we don't have so many issues where uh, drawings are not looking the same when, they, when you print them out. I mean, we're big on that. We, we actually implemented our, uh, our AECOM standards, which are going to go, go out live pretty soon with the pull-down menus that we've created in-house uh, with myself and some other associates um, with the company. Um, it, it's a big one because too many people, to, uh, users tend to you know, go on their own little path when it comes to creating a drawing. We, we want to set something where it's easier for them to, to create and be productive and not have to recreate the wheel, which happens so often in, in a lot of firms. Uh, with our firm, we're trying to streamline it, try to give our clients the best possible uh, documents uh, when we deliver the drawings. And uh, as a CAD manager, I mean, I've pulled a lot of my hair out um, to, to come to the point where we need to establish, and we have come to a point. We're not there yet. It's a live document. Uh, it, it's just a continuous thing. Every day you, you, you hear and absorb and implement, try it, and uh, we just like to have that type of uh, progress going because it makes productivity so much easier. So what tools in AutoCAD do you use to, to help you maintain your CAD standards? Do you customize the CUI files? Yes, we've customized it, and uh, we actually used a lot of the tools that AutoCAD already has it, but just basically brought it from a big gamut to a toolbar where, uh, you know, LT setup, uh, text sizes, borders, everything is easy, point and click. That's what we want to hear, point and click. We don't want to hear reading a manual and taking 20 minutes. It should be easy to use, and that's what it's become. Um, and that makes, <clears throat> you know, the project managers happy where they don't have to see the users, you know, spend two hours setting up a drawing where we can just point and click and it's there in two seconds. And so aside from pointing and clicking, how do you communicate your CAD standards? Do you have a printed manual? Or are you making use of web-based tools? Yeah, we have. Uh, we incorporated the online manual, try to be green. Mm -hmm. um, it's a PDF format. It's on our internet. And also um, we have a help tool in there where we post questions that uh, other coworkers have asked us and we come a, you know we give them a solution to it and we post it it's a little help help file that they can read it we also post the AU website on there so if they need any questions that that may, you know we can't answer they want to go directly to that we we provide that as well so um, you know autodesk uh, catalyst uh, everything that's cad based that we feel uh, is useful for for their knowledge we we put up there so how do, you, and how do you find that CAD standards and CAD management saves your company money? Uh, repetitious work, mm -hmm. um, wrong work, I mean, using outdated material that's not supposed to be used. Uh, when we establish a project, we, we like to sit down, say, this is the game plan, what we did wrong before, let's fix it this time, set a template, use the pull down, say, this is what we want you to do, and we streamlined a lot of the repetitious work, which is like saying recreating the wheel is like, you know, I'm going to say that a lot during this interview, but it's, it's got to be stopped and we have minimized a lot of that. Oh, that's great. So if you had one tip or piece of advice that you would give to a new CAD manager, what would you say? Run? <laughs> no. <laughs> um, a new CAD manager, uh, definitely establish your, the, uh, the company standards. Uh, not, not often do Projects require company standards because some other clients might have their own standards. But when it does come to that, um, set it. You know, set it. Uh, what I used, what I do is basically, new users come in. We give them a 20-minute sit down. Say, this is where we have everything. This is how we would like you to use it. Any questions, you come to me. We'll we'll try to answer the questions. And uh, you know, don't do what you did before where you called things. You know, Timmy one and. Bob four because that's that'll drive you crazy. Productivity is the big thing with us. Well, that's great. Well, thank you so much, Freddie. Well, thank and you, thank you for joining us.